This is not financial advice. I just hope a bunch of them is baby because it's about to get hot in the kitchen. Now, let's talk about it. The first banger on the list is Shiba Inu. Now, Shiba Inu is currently four zeros and three one at the time that I took this screenshot. And I want you to see this. It's currently up basically 41% in the last week. It's up over 286,000% in the last year. However, on the day, it's basically down about 4% five percent in that range it is currently fluctuating so now let's see what's going on with shiba inu check this out here goes some of the news from their official twitter page and it says this there's a new blog and they posted this and it says a metaverse story that begins with an update and what are they doing they are introducing lands now what is lands it says it's a q system and more now leash holders which is a part of shiba inu's ecosystem will be the first to gain access to the Shiba Inu metaverse lands. Now, this is not a suggestion to buy, hold, or sell. I give you the facts and you be the judge. Now, let's keep it going. I want you to join the Discord, hit the link in the top of the comment, make sure you subscribe to the channel, double check that you hit the notification bell, join the Discord so you could be up on any of the plays when we get in, and you can also learn skills for example how when dwac was coming down a little bit i bought a put option made a quick 300 dollars on that and then when bbig was running up bought a call option made a quick almost 500 dollars on that about 430 now you can learn these skills by joining the discord with us i'll see you over there but let's talk about what's going on with shiba inu specifically with this thing called lands because this is one of the news catalysts that has them pumping up now lands it says owning shiba anu virtual real estate let's get straight to it so it says this some of the biggest metaverse platforms are introducing virtual real estate for example sandbox and decentraland where you can buy virtual real estate like literally plots of land in the metaverse over on sandbox over on decentraland and now shiba inu is trying to basically take over all of the things that they're doing there and take some of that let's call it market share right and they said that they are happy to introduce and let's zoom in a bit because i know some of you in the back didn't bring your glasses my notepad bring your glasses here we go now it says this we are happy to announce and proudly introduce sheba lands now again make sure you subscribe to the channel whenever i find out new information like this i will let you know and hit the notification bell so you can be up to date on all of it as it comes out now here we go let's get back to the receipts and it says we are happy to introduce and proudly introduce shiba lands and it says the lands found inside our metaverse so the shiba new metaverse will be available for purchase auction really soon and it will be the first step towards allowing the community to jump into the metaverse prior to its full release. Shiba Inu is trying to get ahead of the game and take over the game with Shiba Inu lands. So let's keep it going. Check this out. Let's get to the details because you know that's important. So it says this in 2022. Their workload has been focused on energizing their ecosystem that Shiba Inu, Leash, and Bone all together to try to grow it and then basically integrate it into your life. So then it says this, by introducing some incredible aspects that they expect to shape the future. And then it says this, the metaverse, let's look more into what they're talking about. They said that the metaverse space is growing rapidly and it's garnering enormous interest from small companies and large companies alike. And the metaverse is said to be one of the biggest growing areas within the crypto space. So we see how NFTs are blowing up. We can imagine that the metaverse space is going to be a place where all of the cryptocurrency, like blockchain technology, NFTs, all of these different aspects of cryptocurrency are all just collected in one spot for commerce, for people to buy hold or sell so now let's check this out it says developers will set up shops basically in the metaverse and they will use it as a great resource for basically again crypto commodities and different other kind of things like that royalties and different kind of content like selling different kind of skins inside of a game or different kind of items or tools or power-ups inside of the metaverse we want to be on the lookout for this and we're happy those of us who like shiba inu are happy to see that they are trying to get ahead of the game on this so then it says this in 2020 alone according to this article the metaverse was worth 478.7 billion dollars and that's roughly the same size as the entire home service industry in the united states alone and it says like everything shib does 
they will lead this metaverse sector. This is what they're telling us. They say that they are going to be among the leaders, if not the leader, within the metaverse sector. Now, let's keep it going. Let's get back to some of the facts. So, we already said that they're introducing Shiba and New Lands. That's the most important part about this video that I want you to understand that. Shiba and New Lands. Do not forget that. But let's keep it going. They said this. Owning a piece of Shiba New real estate in Shiba New Lands will bring an array of benefits and more information on this will be shared soon. This is why I ask you to hit the notification bell so when I find out, boom, I'll get it out to you as soon as I find out. So now, we want to see, shared really soon, what else do they have that they are holding back and not yet releasing? But I'll tell you as soon as we know. So you may be asking yourself, who would really buy some virtual land? Why would you buy virtual land when you can go and buy real land, right? And it says this, this is the New York Times, another reputable news source when it comes to them finding receipts and actually telling you what they found. So let's check this out. The New York Times said this, investors snap up real estate in virtual lands, right? And there's a boom where there's a lot of this happening. For example, they said a transaction for properties in the digital realms, basically they're jumping and it's guided by the same principles as the physical world. What is it all about family? It's about location, location, location. So Here's an example of that, a primary example, because you know I got the receipts. Check this out. It says right here that Snoop Dogg is developing a Snoop verse, and someone just bought property or a property in his virtual land for almost half a million dollars. Now, this happened about in December or so, but this recently was half a million dollars in virtual land bought so they could live where it says this an nft collector bought land next door to snoop dogg's house in the snoop verse for almost half a million dollars why did they do that because they know if this is the snoop verse and there are going to be many 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 different avatars and characters in this metaverse then guess what a lot of them may show up to snoop dogg's house to do whatever is going on there but understand Living next door to Snoop Dogg would introduce you to a lot of traffic, right? Put in a really high traffic area so then it would be valuable in the metaverse rather than having a spot that was totally empty, but then there was no one around. Do you see what I'm saying here? So then check this out. There are other pieces of land being bought for about $2.4 million. This is virtual real estate. Again, why do they do this? It's about location, location, location. I want you to think of this. Imagine that people are going to load up into the metaverse and you can imagine maybe there's going to be some spawn spots where people spawn in and they just load up into the game and then all of a sudden you know what you end up in some big giant house or some big giant mall or something like that then it would be advantageous for people who are trying to sell let's call it nfts in the metaverse or shirts or weapons or anything for your characters in the metaverse if you have a shop right next to where people are spawning in then it's very likely that people can come on over and pay in whatever the resource or whatever the currency is in the metaverse whether it be ethereum or shiba inu or anything that they're paying with in there and then you can transact with them and actually make money in the metaverse just from being in a good location so then let's keep it going check this out Shiba Inu, another thing they have going on, I'll, listen, we're not going to judge them, but you be the judge. They're flirting with Coinbase online, and they said this. Shiba Inu's official Twitter page, they said, hey, Coinbase, send us a DM. I'm not going to judge. We're just going to read the facts. Valentine's Day is approaching, and we have a pending match. They sent them a kissy face, and they said, you and me, and then they put a wink, right? So they're joking around. They're flirting around, and again, we won't judge. They do what they, whatever they want to do, right? It's their Twitter account. They can post what they want. But what is this telling us? Maybe something is going to happen on Valentine's Day with Coinbase and Chiba Inu. Could it be the release of Bone and Leash or something else related to the metaverse on Valentine's Day? Some information? Let's just be on the lookout for that. And this thing got over... 24.9 thousand likes so a lot of people have seen this but let's keep it going so with all of this going on shiba Inu was among the top trending things on twitter today in the technology space so when you see this trending on twitter 33.6 thousand tweets and at the time of this recording it even went all the way up near about 37 thousand tweets within a short time frame about shiba inu so it's garnering a lot of attention and keep in mind you can look up 
how often is something being searched on the internet when you go to Google Trends? So then I went ahead and did that for you. So you can see that right here, this bar, this red bar is indicative of the number 100, which tells us that in the last 30 days, Shiba Inu has reached a peak amount of searches over this entire last 30 day span. So many people are trying to watch Shiba Inu and see what is it going to do. And when you look at the volume, it's all the way up to $3.6 billion basically being traded of Shiba Inu back and forth. It says that it's down 26% from yesterday, but keep in mind, just one week ago, this wasn't even in the billions at all. It was close to 800 million, but now there's 3.6 billion traded. Now, why is this number down? Because we talked about this yesterday, where there was a bit of a short squeeze with Shiba Inu, where many positions were liquidated from the short sellers of Shiba Inu. Believe it or not, there are short sellers of Shiba Inu. I'll link a video up right here so you can see exactly what happened with that. So, and I'll link it also at the end of this video so you can see what happened with the short squeeze of Shiba Inu. But when you get a lot of buying pressure, like a short squeeze, for example, it's you can't maintain it for a long time. So then you'll get a little bit of a drop off on the volume. But notice, the volume is still ridiculously high in the last 24 hours to the point that there is still 68.2% buying and only 31% selling of Shiba Inu. So now let's talk about the burns of Shiba Inu. Currently there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven burns of Shiba Inu in the last 24 hours. Many from Stephen Cooper at, with Bigger Entertainment, which is one of the first cryptocurrency related playlist that burn Shiba Inu as you play their music and then you got Binance and then another one called Shibarian basically Chronicles who burn Shiba Inu but speaking of Stephen Cooper and everything like that he has a campaign now where he just posted this five hours ago where they're excited to present their new Shib burn jerseys and he says he personally loves these and it's related to the Super Bowl where people can buy these jerseys I'm not saying that you should I'm just giving you the information and the facts people are going to buy these jerseys and then they're going to use some of the proceeds to my knowledge to burn Shiba Inu you go and double check now last thing is Shiba Inu Basically, one of the biggest burn parties that they're going to have for Shiba Inu is happening on Valentine's Day, which is February 14th. The Shib lovers, they're going to have a burn party. They're offering tickets for $5. And last time, they burned a whole lot of Shiba Inu. And this one is supposed to be bigger than that one. So be on the lookout for that. And now let's get back to the technical analysis part of Shiba Inu as to what numbers you need to keep an eye on. So we talked about this before, how Shiba Inu is bouncing off of this many zeros and 32 level and it's finding resistance and weakness up here and it is showing us that if it can't break above these levels the four zeros 32 the four zeros 34 or 44 and the four zeros 52 if it can't break these levels here then that means that this little run up is just retracement and it may continue down back all the way to the many zeros and five it's at many zeros and 32 now but this downtrend is telling us that if it can't break these resistance levels it's going to the many zeros and five at least in the short term but we want to see it run up but again the technical analysis it is what it is i'll tell you the good the bad and the ugly i got your back i want to see you over on the discord and i keep you up to date on everything going on with shiba inu what i want you to do is hit the like button on your way out join the discord the link is in the top and if you can't handle the heat of these hot stocks and stay out of the kitchen consider investing in index funds everybody take care